Okay, this is a walk around video of my 1991 BMW 856-speed. This is a 28,000 mile car that I've owned over 20 years. It's in my warehouse building right now. Uh, usually sits in my home garage, uh, show car garage there. But uh, we've got it over here right now just for a change of pace. Um, so while I got it out, I'm doing the video. This is uh, December 15th, uh, 2021. And uh, I've got a ton of pictures of this car, but I haven't really done a lot of videos on it. And this is kind of what we got here. And this is a 91, but it has the 850 CSI parts, the body kit on it, which is the bumpers front and rear, lower sections, which uh, they've been on the car for, oh, 15 of its 20 years, maybe longer. Uh, bought them brand new at BMW when they were still available. And of course the wheels are in parallel. And they are the staggered ones, and those are the BMW factory ones, not uh, the aftermarket ones. Um, what we got going on here? That's kind of that. And here's the back section. And that is the plate it has. And if you notice, it's a. 1991 historic plate. This is a historic car now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. And I've got some pictures of the undercarriage on the uh, YouTube videos also. So you can see the bottom of this car up on the lift here in this building where it's kept. And it's sitting next to a uh, tuner uh, M3 convertible with a blower on it, Powerdyne system on it. RMS car, they built that. It's kind of a neat car, but this is about this car here. And uh, this, this car is all original, all the paint, every body panel. Uh, obviously, the, the lower CSI kits were painted. They were painted 40 miles away from the car at a body shop when they were off of the car. Uh, the uh, brakes are uh, the factory upgrade Brembo BMW brakes that are on there. Other than that, and the uh, cat back system, it's pretty much stock. It does have uh, the chips in it, um, which I have all documented on my website. And this car runs fairly, fairly good. And, uh, the inside, <clears throat> probably not best lighting for that. And I will pop the hood here in just a minute and start it. the car has uh, high dollar tires on it all Michelin Pilot Sports no Nang Kangs or one of the cheap tires it's the good stuff this car is a unlimited budget whatever it takes car and there's the seats I said probably not the best lighting but they're literally as good as you're gonna ever see and while we're here this is the miles and December of 2015. So what does that got on there? 28,539 miles. Turn it back off. Pop the hood. And you can see how nice the paint is on this car. It's detailed to the nines by myself and one of my guys here, somewhere over there. Um, okay. And there's the V12 M70 motor. Um, and uh, like I said, there's no 
no aftermarket parts on this thing. It even has the original air, BMW air filters in it. Uh, the uh, M cover is added to this car. It's a factory part hard to find. It took me, oh, about a year to find that thing when I did back in probably 2004 or something like that. Hmm. But, uh, Probably, I haven't had to do a lot of work to this car. Of course, you know, the oil's changed, it's all maintained. Uh, I did do the master cylinder on it, which I rebuilt the original one. It was dripping a little bit out of the back seal, like some of these will do. And uh, that's actually why it's here. Uh, it's all been done. And so, did that and flushed out the uh, power steering and hydro boost system, put new fluid in that. Just some basic maintenance. All right, I'm gonna go walk around and start it up now. It still has our original format. <clears throat>
trust it for much, but it's there. And of course, this car has the cell phone option, which it does function. I'm going to turn it on. It's been a while. It's down over here. There it is. service to it but the system works and it'll come across the speakers and it has CD changer and it does have disc in there and that's uh, Saturday Night Special now from the Crescent City and 